get ready with me. Tonight I'm going to my friend's house for a holiday party. So i um, just going to go through it. So sorry as I reach for things over here and look for things in the mirror. First thing I'm going to do is put on some moisturizer. I am using the Simple um, Replenishing Rich Moisturizer. This is actually something I had, not this moisturizer, but this um, kind of little method that I'm doing is something I had just seen on a YouTube video from a stylist. Um, I just watched the video this week. I mean, I'm sure it's probably like an old video, but I just watched it this week. So, oops, excuse me, gotta grab for my brushes. Okay. The next thing I'm going to do is put on some translucent powder. So this is the, here we go, the City HD powder. And, oh gosh, this one always, it's, it kind of makes a mess a little bit. So, uh, okay. This is going to kind of just brush that on. La, 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 la. Okay. Whoa. Bumped into the camera there. Okay. So the next thing, oh gosh, this, oh, okay, the next thing I'm going to do is put on my foundation, and as I used last time, I am still using the L'Oreal True Match um, foundation in um, neutral buff, neutral natural buff. So what I'm going to do is I just put a little dab kind of all around. I did it again. Forgot to put primer on, but oh well, too late for that. Um, I was going to use this Smashbox, Smashbox Photo Finish Primer that I got in my Ipsy bag, but I guess not. So I am just going to, sorry as I look in the mirror over here, I am just going to kind of brush this in. I'm using a foundation brush from e.l.f. Um, e.l.f. is actually a really good, um, bottom, I don't want to say bottom line, but like drugstore line of, um, makeup and brushes. You can find them at CVS, and so a lot of the things, oh, it got a little weird on my nose area. Sorry, you can't see that because I was looking in the mirror. Okay, so we're going to say good for now. Okay, so let's move on to my eyes. Once again, I am using the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. Gosh, this never focuses good. Alright, well, it is the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. And so what I'm going to do here is I just put a little bit on my finger. And I'm just going to... Kind of just put it onto my eyes using my ring finger because it provides a good amount of pressure without providing without too much pressure. Put the cap back on there. And I know I said this last time, but I gotta get better lighting because the lighting that you guys are seeing right now, I look really pale and washed out and but the what I'm seeing in person is a lot better. Okay, so I'm going to start. Yes, I'm going to start with this Trace Tracique. I don't really know how to say it. It's an eye crayon, and it's in the color Kona Coffee. And so what I'm going to do with that is I'm almost using it as an kind of just putting it in the inner and outer corners, sorry my hand was in front of my eye, my mouth is really not okay, inner and out of corners, and of course, if you look at it right now, it probably looks a little weird, but no fear, we're gonna make it better. So now I'm using my Nika K New York Eyeshadow Quad, another Ipsy thing that I got, and let's see, I'm gonna use this shade right here, to kind of just go up into my brow bone and then I'm going to use this one this darker color right 
and put it all over my eyes. So it actually kind of goes right over the eye crayon that I had before. Then I'm gonna take this lighter color and kind of just kind of go in with my uh, more precision edge brush and kind of put that on the inner and the outer corners of my eyes. And I'm going to now, okay, so I am now going to use this um, makeup of the day um, eyeliner in bronze. So there it is. And again, apologize as I look to the mirror over here. But um, I go right underneath my eye and I do this in little strokes because I find that I have more control over it this way. Let's see. And I do not go into my waterline because even though it gives it a kind of more nighttime look, I just don't like makeup getting into my eyeballs and my and probably getting into my contacts. Even though I'm going to be throwing these contacts away, I'm at the end of the cycle, I still don't like it. Okay. I'm trying to see how I can get you to have better lighting. Alright, and then I also like to do a little smudge, 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 smudge. Okay, next. Mascara. Okay, so I am going to take my handy dandy eyelash curler. Let's see, can you see better if I have my bangs back so you can kind of get a better idea of what is happening. And if you are like my friend Shoshana out there, you love when I pull my bangs back. I don't know why. It's just an obsession. So, put those back down. Oh gosh. See, this is why I do my hair after I do my makeup because I end up doing things like this. So now I'm taking uh, Sephora's Lash Plumper Mascara and it's got this kind of big, you see this big kind of fluffy brush in there. So I'll push my bangs back again. And I'm wiggling and up and wiggle and up. And same thing on the bottom lashes. The lap. And then what I like to do is just kind of make sure that I get these outer lashes because it kind of gives your eyes, kind of opens them up a little bit and then really quick kind of with the point of the brush lightly touch the inner pieces just to make sure that I got them all. Okay. You see what's happening? Okay. Uh, okay. Next, I am moving on to blush. Let's try to fix this right here. Alright. Here I'm at blush. Ugh. Sorry about that. Blush I'm using at the moment, Hakari Blush in Tango. It is a very peach pink blush, so I just lightly dab, kind of shake it out, and brush it in. It comes out really pink at first, and then you just keep kind of brushing it in. And it kind of blends in. If you're not, if you don't blend it in good, I always like to do this, um, you will look like a five-year-old who tried to put on her mom's makeup and have a big pink spot on your cheeks. Okay, almost at the end here. My What's Up from Benefit. Uh, oh wow, I open that up super much. Okay, so I like to just kind of put some in my upper cheek up to the outside area. Kind of just adds a little luminescence. There we go. There, um, down the 
and blend it in onto my nose, a little bit on the cupid's bow. There we go. Alrighty. Uh, I'm gonna give it a little bit in the inner corners of my eyes. Let's see, I feel like, there we go, I'm gonna do, it's a holiday party. I'm gonna do a little more here. Okay, and lastly, lipstick. I am using um, a different grape from Clinique. This is the color right here. So, I'm gonna go ahead and put that on. Mm -hmm. How's this looking? Looking like I need to blend it in some more. Okay. Hmm. Alrighty. I think I'm gonna take a little bit of a lipstick brush. This is just a uh, lipstick brush from H&M. And just kind of... Oh gosh, that made it worse. Just trying to blend it in. Uh, can you see that on the bottom? It looks like I don't know what I'm doing because sometimes I do wing it and I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, let's just see if we can. Beauty tip. I always have a black washcloth handy and this is also what I use to take off my makeup. I like black because then when it gets stained with all of your makeup, you can't really see it. Okay, so I'm done. What do you think of the finished look? Pull my hair back so you can kind of see the eyes. Can you see them? You can. All right, I'm gonna try to um, get a picture maybe in some better light so that you can see it a little bit better, but I will try to um, list all of the products in the down bar below. If you have not subscribed yet to my channel, please subscribe. Leave me comments as to what you're doing for the holidays and how you get ready. And if you are interested in Ipsy, where I mentioned I got a couple of these makeup items from, I will leave a link in the description box below. and. Um, you can join. It is $10 a month and you get a whole bunch of um, products. I'll actually be making a video soon. It may or may not be up before or after this video, but going over what I got in my December Ipsy box or bag. I don't know why I keep saying box, but anyway, $10 a month, great value. Um, really enjoying it. So um, have a great holiday and I will see you guys soon.